Hello everyone, this is Rose with The Crafted Rose. I just wanted you to see my lovely new traveler's notebook that I made. I used the Bow Bunny Sweet Clementine collection to make this. It's made out of that paper, some cardstock, chipboard, glue, tape, brads, buttons, and strings. Here you can see a sweet vintage bow button used to give that string on the policy envelope, envelope some weight. You untie it there and inside are four cards coordinating to the Bow Bunny Sweet Clementine collection. Um, they're blank inside and they come with envelopes. There's a purple ink pen in there and there's plenty of storage room in that folder for anything else that you might desire to put in there. Alright, so there's the pen. I'm going to close that back up and give you another chance to see how the closure works and to look at that pretty vintage button. I believe it's from the 80s. Um, Alright, and then we're going to move on to the first book. It is a standard journaling notebook. On the inside there's a place to write your name and stuff. There's plenty of room here to write whatever it is you desire. And then in the back there is a ruler. You'll see moving into the next one, this is my first attempt at a junk journal style notebook. There are lots of places to put photos in and to write extra little notes and to store memorabilia. You can see all the paper coordinates. There are some non-collection um, papers like this one here which is a handmade paper and some tissue paper and other things throughout. Just a fun little way to keep your memories safe and to write about your life as you go through it. Moving on, you'll see the third and final notebook also coordinates with the outside covers but is a standard notebook as well. All of the notebooks are attached with elastic in the standard tra traveler's notebook style so they're easily removed and replaced. Here on the back cover you'll see a waterfall style note holder or photo matting area. There is enough room for 10 photos in there I believe. It might be more. It closes with a magnet closure and then this heart here again coordinates with the paper set and is a great place to put a small picture or write notes or whatever you want to do with it. When you flip it over on the back it's got a nice um, design on there and then on the spine, I'm fiddling with it right now, you can see some tassels and charms to really bring the book together. There's also a label on that spine for you to write whatever you want. Thank you so much for your time and have a lovely day.